everybody. Hi, it's Lily. And Ellen. Today, we will be giving, um, basically, we're going to be seeing which game is better, Overlook Bay or Adopt Me. So, Overlook Bay versus Adopt Me. Right, Ellie? So, we don't know, so basically we're just going to be really just looking and comparing Adopt Me to Overlook Bay. Um, we'll start in Overlook Bay and then we'll go into Adopt Me and compare. So, first let's head to the town. We can compare things in Adopt Me or the town. So let's go see. Right, so this is the town, and we're just gonna be doing Overlook Bay versus, well, Dot Me versus Overlook Bay, technically. So let's see. Um, Ellie, where should we start off at first? Why don't you teleport to me? Yeah. So we can go together. Okay. So, where should we head first to? How about the pet shop? We can compare it to the nursery and adopt me to this pet shop. We're just comparing in this video. If you want to learn more about the pet shop and about the new update in the pet shop, check out one of our last videos called the pet shop, Roblox Overlook Bay, the pet shop update. Check that out. Okay, so this is it. We've got plenty of stuff to do in it and everything like that. I don't think it's like the nursery because Adopt Me has eggs and Overlook Bay has pet pods. I, know, I honestly don't know which is better because in Adopt Me, you do needs for your eggs for them hatch. In Overlook Bay, you throw the pet pod and it opens up. Ellie, do you have an opinion of what you think is better? No, I think they're both good. Okay. So do I. Okay, let's move on. So, Overlook Bay and Adopt Me have completely different, let's say, pet shops, because over um, Adopt Me is called the nurseries, but they both have completely different concepts. Right, Ellie? Okay, so where should we head to next? How about the vehicle shop? There's two vehicle there's two car shops in Overlook Bay. Um one is the personalized vehicles and one is the car dealership. In Adopt Me, there is only one car shop. So let's check out the car dealership first because it's basically just the regular everyday cars. Okay, um, we're in. So it's basically the regular everyday cars. Um, you click on one and you can scroll through. So 1,500, 700, and 2,500. I have this car, it's 2,500, and everybody gets the regular car. If you wanna buy another one of the regular ones, then it's 700 gems. Okay, moving on, uh, let's go out. Next is... Over there. Yeah, teleporting, well, not teleporting, but driving to the personalized vehicles. Ellie, which, I um, I kind of think the personalized vehicles is a little better than Adopt Me's. They have They have more options, you know what I mean? What? They have more options in the personalized vehicle shop than in Adopt Me's car shop. Yeah, different crates. Um, so you can talk to Flint. You can go into shop, and these are all the different crates you can get. 
Uh, where should we go next, Deli? Okay, how about the train station? Well, maybe they're going to use it for a different update. We don't know. Okay, um, let's head to... Actually, you know what? Let's head over to Adopt Me. We've showed some things in Overlook Bay. Now let's show Adopt Me. Okay? Mm -hmm. Hi! Hello. It's Lily again. I'm Alice. And we're here in Adopt Me now. So we had compared Overlook Bay, and it is time to get into Adopt Me. So the first thing we're going to compare, just like how I compared Overlook Bay, we compared the pet shop in Overlook Bay. Well, this is the nursery where you get pets in Adopt Me. So, let's go in and see the difference. So, as you can tell, over Look Bay's pet shop is way different than Adopt Me's pet shop. We're in Adopt Me's pet shop right now. Mm -hmm. Oh, cool. So, as you can see, they're nice. There are these charts, and they show you all the pets you have basically um also so basically you got the royal egg and this is sir woofington so you can talk to him i can tell by the look on your face that you're confused how i can speak well you see that specimen in the cheapest shop he had an experiment done on us and bert and well there was a parading shift in our brain swapped so the fellow thinks he's a dog anyway have a good day and make sure to buy my egg the most premium egg in all the lands so the pre the most premium egg is the royal egg and the guy he was talking about in the cheapest stand is over here with the cracked egg yeah a bag, cracked egg, a oh get it out so they can see I think it's a Oh, so cool. And it's just a cracker. It Neat. doesn't change. <laughs> well, fossil eggs do. The gumball machines always change. Yeah. So there's also these charts. So the current egg is the fossil egg. Next egg is the question marks. It's 25% common, 30% uncommon, 25% rare, 15% ultra rare, and 5% legendary. Okay. So there's your chances you're going to get it. You're going to hatch something in the fossil egg. egg. There's no egg coming. Well, there's always going to be another egg. So this is from the gumball machine before the fossil egg. It's the Aussie egg. Um, The most legendary one I have from... The fossil egg over here is, I'm going to say, so my T-Rex is my most rarest. It's a ride T-Rex and it's the rarest from the fossil eggs that I have. Ellie has the dodo. You want to get out your dodo to show them? So these are the only two legendaries in the fossil eggs that you have a 5% chance of hatching. And that's the dodo right there, and that's the T-Rex. So basically, um, yeah. Those are our rarest ones we have in the fossil egg. Okay, so next thing is, how about a car shop? Okay, we are here at the car shop. So we compared Overlook Bay's. Now we're in Adopt Me's. This is Adopt Me's car shop. So there's all different cars. And yeah, basically the most expensive one is the muscle car. Ellie, which is your favorite car? I think, oh, I don't really know, um, maybe, maybe this one because it's simple. I like the muscle car. You like the muscle car? I think I used to have a muscle car. I traded oh, it though. Oh, no, I do I like the camper. Oh, okay, so the camper. The camper's a lot of money, but the camper has a lot. 
Yeah. Okay, so. That's it. Yeah, that's it. Um, I honestly don't really have an opinion. I think Overlook Bay and Adopt Me are both really good games. What do you think, Ellie? I'm too sure to invite them. I'm not too sure to invite Yeah, I think Adopt Me and Overlook Bay are both really good games, and I can't really choose which one is better. Okay, so that is it for our video today. Bye. Bye. Bye.